in a minute y'all finna see the boom boom moving truck lane. Oh, I'm not sure what to give you. Mm -hmm. So we do upper training for a class A commercial license and we train only on manual transmissions. Only on manual? Mm -hmm. uh, mm -hmm. Is that what you're looking for? I, I don't mind, I thought, I thought most of them are automatic. If you, if you I don't know about y'all, man, but if they got some money on the wood, man, for somebody to go to school or just some money on the wood, period, man, I'm finna go get that. But everybody that been tapping in with me, asking about where they can get the information, you know, to, to do it, it's right here. Arizona Works, you feel me? Like, they got that bag for us right now, man. They dropping that money off, man. You know what I'm saying? Y'all better go and get that. Look, I'm finna get these CDLs. Everybody know this is where the money at right here. Commercial driver license. Yeah. Yeah, I'm for sure over here filling out big packet to get that grant money made. Yeah, how about? Yeah, these are the little steps you gotta fill out right here. Nothing too major, you feel me? They asking for for you to do a little research about what it is that you wanna do. You know what I'm saying? And then it's player because you can plug the info in right here. You feel me? So, you know, I'm ASAP Googling everything I need to Google. You feel me? Yeah. Mm. And just the last module I got to complete right here for me to um, look at my ready weight. You know what I'm talking about? First person, I'm ready to go early. I'm going to, this is I'm basically walking through how to complete the rest of it. But anybody who wants that that grant out here in Arizona, this is it right here, man. Got ten thousand dollars to pay for you to go to school, cause they trying to stimulate the workforce out here in AZ, man. Free money, tap in. Hello, is this Eva Castro? Uh, doing a orientation. Hello, Eva, are you there? Uh, Hello, in you know? regards yes, to the you. grant to pay all for right. my well, truck we driving school. Well, we Look at all these people. Trying to get them CDLs, man. You know what I'm saying? Nail tech, dental assistant. You know what I'm saying? Right. You feel me? So Big grant all day. Everybody get a chance to. Super cool. You can go back here if you want to. Yeah, it's a nice one. When you graduate, they send you your certificate and your CDL license, okay? Okay. And if you happen to get it up, you also need to know about that. That'll all be in. Hey Marcus, um, this is Sue at Arizona at Work, Maricopa County, just letting you know that all your paperwork has gone through. I will be sending you a voucher to sign. Um, I don't know if you were aware, I got a... Hey, y'all see that shit? Marquise, congratulations, you have been approved for the grant. You feel me? Boom, boom, moving, man. I'm finna get these CDLs. Oh, that's about to be me, y'all. Big truck driving on deck, man. For real. Oh, look, look, look. They getting it in. Boy, y'all see, I ain't playing, man. This is where we learning that. Yeah, man, y'all see that thing, man? We finna start this pre-trip inspection right now, man. You know what I'm saying? I got all four of my lights working in the back. <laughs> From the front, I see the windows are clear, not cracked. I see all the lights have <laughs> stuff working. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? My headlights are clear, not foggy. You know what I'm saying? I don't see no leaks. I don't see no oil on the ground. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. He ready to go. Mm. So 
supposed to do. For sure, how I'm gonna be coming through hauling them cars, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Bam, bam for each one of these things. You feel me? One, two, three, four bands. Yeah. Shit, I really don't even know for if I want to do the over the road shit because the little five bands of money is cool. And with that, I can still, um, I can still do what you gonna call it. Um, I can still do my music videos and shit. All right, man, it's about time for Young Boone to get back behind the wheel, man. It is good Freightliner thing right here. Y'all see me? Yeah, man, big bussy bus down around this thing, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's Southwest trucking right there, man. You know what I'm talking about? Let me make sure. Let me do my little pre-trip real quick. You know what I'm saying? My uh, 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 emergency and my service wires and my electrical wires is connected by the glad hands. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. My tire tread is rubbing evenly. You know what I'm saying? Look at them airbags connected by the mount and that fifth wheel slider right there. You know what I'm saying? No, no space in between the fifth wheel and the apron. You know what I'm saying? Everything is properly mounted and secure. No cracks or no damage. No leaks. You know what I'm saying? I'm ready for my pre-trip inspection. You know what I'm saying? All my air brake hoses right there. You no know, abrasion bulges or cuts. Yeah. Back of my trailer all locked up. You know what I'm saying? Young student driver. Yeah, man. Have to go give me a little Red Bull, but as you can see, we back at it again. Southwest Trucking getting that CDL. You know, they over there on the lot. You know what I'm saying? Going over big pre-trip inspections back there. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. In a, in a good two weeks, I'm gonna be right there. Boom, boom, moving. Okay, got a little straight backing up going on over here yeah yeah man <laughs> get boom up in that thing man it's like a whip of fuel you know what I'm saying okay Just finished the first day of the CDL school. Instantly about to go to work. Doing live. Gotta go get to the money. Until I can get to that money over there. You feel me? I'm trying to get to that bag. Yeah. Oh, gee, like he, he hopping in that Harley thing. Yeah, man. Big CDL training all day. Boom, boom, moving, coming through. Yeah. All right, see you in the morning. Day two, came out with a flat tire, but still on time. I've been actually watching a bunch of videos about, you know, uh, the stuff I need to know to pass my general knowledge test. You know what I'm saying? So I could be prepared to go up in there and get that good permit, but, on my way back in the class, forgot my glasses in the car. They decided they didn't want any glasses. So it sits out here. But this is actually the brake drum. It bolts to this wheel. Okay? The inside of that brake drum is where the Shoes, push up against the 
So the shoes press up against the drum. Break chamber. It has a spring brake housing in it. It also contains a service brake. So this is actually two lines in there. It's going to be in two different areas. When you send the air out of your yellow knob, which releases your spring brakes, it cages the spring brakes in here so that they're collapsed. There's another diaphragm in here that when you send air through this, it pushes that diaphragm in and out, which twists this slack adjuster that turns this S cam. Okay? Slack adjuster is push rod pushes them out. Slack adjuster twists the chamber or the brake cam, which is an S cam. That S cam then rotates between the springs, the shoes, and push up against the inside of that drum. Then you have return springs that once you release your air pressure, these are freed. Those return springs move it back into position. Okay? It's a little easier to see this way than it is here on that giant. I think they got it right. Big CDL truck driving on the way, man. You know what I'm saying? Boom, boom, moving, coming through, man. You know what I'm saying? It's just the first part of boom, boom transportation. You know, we're going to get the truck and the trailer, and then we're going to use that to fund getting these products overseas shipped over here. You feel me? Whether through a plane, the railroad, or ships. You know what I'm saying? And once we get it over here, you know what I'm saying? We got the truck to get it on the road to get it to where it needs to go. You feel me? We're moving products, man. Global global we're moving products around the world it ain't gotta just be over here in the u.s man you know what i'm saying we're gonna get it made over there and we're gonna ship it to where you know they want to they, they, they want to spend some more money for it you know? for real all right man just finished up day two we went over combinations we went over air brakes you know what i'm saying we was going over every damn thing up in there you know what I'm saying? But I need to go home and do some more studying on my own because that's how I know for sure I'm gonna be ready to take my test, you feel me? But I'm about to go over to this spot and see if I'll get my tire fixed because my PSI was low when I uh, started him up this morning, man. So yeah, that's what I'm finna go do. And uh, right back at it tomorrow. Oh, heading in for day three. Good CDL training. Yeah. What's up, OG? Top of the morning. Yeah, man. Tomorrow I'm about to be taking my uh my permit. You know what I'm 
know what I'm saying? Let me in there, coach. Let me in there. I'm gonna try this up in there. I'm ready to go. See, that's why I like my warranty with discount tire. They get you back right immediately. You know what I'm saying? Tire fits just like that. You know what I'm talking about? Back to class, man. You know what I'm saying? Big uh, permit test tomorrow. You know what I'm saying? It's going down. <laughs> But yeah, though, the trucking school is the business, too, because if they getting five bands for each student and they got 20, uh, 20 students, that's 100,000. <laughs> yeah, man. One more hour today, and it's over. You feel me? Yeah. It's almost that time. Tomorrow, I'm going to go take that test to get that permit. I'm going to choo, 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 choo. You feel me? I want to get all the endorsements and all that good shit, but I don't even know when I'm going to slide through and get them. But look, 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 you know what I'm saying? Uh, I don't know, staff parking, student parking. All right, man, just finished up day three of my CDL truck driving training here at Southwest Trucking. You know what I'm saying? I know they back there on the range, man. They out there getting to it. They finna be on the road. But yeah, man, just let me know I need to do. Uh, we gonna come in and go over a bunch of questions and stuff tomorrow before we gotta go and take the uh, the uh, uh, test to get the permit. And then after that, we gotta do the drug screening. And I'm feeling real good about that because I know I'm clean, you know what I'm saying? I ain't smoke nothing. But um, yeah, once I get that deal, gotta register with the clearing house. And then, you know what I'm saying, get all that good stuff turned into them. And then I'm on my way, man. You know what I'm saying, to the range we go. You know I mean? But as you know, time for me to get to work. Gotta get the hustle. Should go wash my car, it's dirty though. All right, y'all, I'm out. Alright man, on my way to go take the permit. You feel me? Yeah man, let's go ahead and get this CDL man. You know what I'm saying? It's about that time. Yeah, I'm gonna stop at the crib, go get my little documents I need to bring with me and head over there and knock it out, man. You know what I'm talking about? Easy money. They just gave us all the answers. Okay, I did it, y'all. All right, man, I just passed my test, man. I did it, y'all. Yeah, yeah. I got the commercial driver's license permit right here in my head. You feel me? I passed the general knowledge. I passed the air brakes and the combination. I was in there knocking them questions out like, boom, bam, boom, bam, boom, bam. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Now I'm finna go. I'm, a, I'm finna be on the range next week. You know what I'm saying? Not this week, but the next week. And then I'm gonna knock out that driving part too. You feel me? I'm finna be coming through in that big boom, boom, moving truck. You feel me? All right, man, it's my first day back to school. I have to get my permit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, man, I'm ready to knock out this, this other week of this class and then off to the range. I'm doing my thing. We that Snyder recruiter just slid through there talking about uh, flying, flying you all over the place to drive, uh, uh, you know, into the rail yards or whatnot, and uh, talking about it's gonna pay a good hundred and ten thousand though. Like, oh, they talking that's the highest paying one right there. They said that's next generation pay right there. You hear me? Yeah, you know what I'm saying. But they got a whole lot of different little positions or whatnot. You know what I mean? And I had to uh, get up out of there because I got stuff I need to go do. But at the same time, though, I'm about ready to go to that website and see if I could get one of them good $5,000 sign-on bonuses. You feel me? Yeah. This is day, I don't know. <laughs> but it's almost over. Actually, this is the second to the last day in the classroom. Yeah, man. So, to do this 
average truck driver see, you know, they want you on this little system or whatever to how you do random drug tests, right? So, you know, I do it, you know, months, a few months without smoking and I uh, went and took my drug test last Thursday. So it was funny because the lady was like, oh yeah, now that you took your test, you can, you can smoke now. And I'm like, no. You feel me? Not as, not if I'm trying to get a job right now, like you feel me? Like I'm trying because they're gonna test you again at the job. You feel me? So I'm like, not if I want to get to the bag. You feel me? So I'm sitting in class today, and I get a little notification that they wanted me to go do a random drug test. And I'm like, damn, y'all random drug testing me again already? You feel me? It's a good thing I didn't go blow that tank down, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But now I'm on track to really get to that bag. You feel me? I ain't playing out here. All right, man, my last day up in the uh, classroom before we get to hit the range and get in the trucks. This is what we're gonna be practicing and learning that. You know what I'm saying? We messing with Southwest Trucking, man. You know what I'm saying? They got a good program going right here. Tap in with them over them other dudes, man. Yeah, yeah, there it go. So it's finally time to go and get on the truck. Finally on the way, man, to the truck. You know what I'm saying? It's going down. We on the range. A little, a little preview of the range. Finna do our first little pre-trip. It's real, man. We done made it inside of the truck, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? For real. John, this is the truck we'll be using with you. All right, so I just finished up my last day in the classroom, and it just so happened to rain. You know what I'm saying? What's going on, boss? Uh huh. Yeah, man. But today I seen people actually uh, taking their test and uh, passing and getting their, uh, you know, uh, their paper to take down to get their uh, CDLs. You know, so yeah, man. This the spot. It's where it's at. So I don't know why Brett left these windows up when it's raining out here, but. You know, shout out to Southwest Trucking. You know what I'm saying? Got the red thing out here. You feel me? It's big monsoon ain't coming through. I'm still finna go to work. Cause you know, I gotta get this chicken. But yeah, they just had the flatbed recruiter up in there. And uh, everybody ended up leaving. She came up in there. It was only four people up in there. One dude, his his documents ain't together, so he can't get his. The other dude, he, he got a dirty test on his jacket, he can't get his. And the other dude, like he going to go drive with his with his dad, so shit. And I'm trying to do hot shot with the truck, so but I stayed in there and listened out of respect. Yeah. Trying to knock out this uh this shit at the range, man. <laughs> Yeah, man, we on to the truck now. You feel me? Yeah, buddy. About to go ahead and uh, slide up in that big thing over there, man. Properly mounted, not damaged and secured, right? All right, so just did my first parallel. And when you're going backwards, if you can't see your tires on the left, you turn your wheel to the right. And if you can't see your wheels on the right, you turn the tires, you turn the wheel to the left. Okay, note to self. All right, the first day on the range was a success. I feel like I did pretty good backing up straight, but definitely need to keep practicing. The parallel park was good, but that was a driver's side for the actual test. It's gonna be on the passenger side and did the offset. Definitely need more practice with that, but you feel me? Ready to get them good CDLs, man. It's almost that time. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's going down. 
does too. Alright, so this here is your air compressor, the red one, see? With uh -huh. the silver line going to it. Okay. Okay, that's your air compressor. Mm -hmm. Behind that, if you look at the hose, watch where the hose goes. See where the hose goes? Right to the right to the power steering. Okay. See? It goes mm -hmm. right to the power steering. So if you forget what it is, it's a power steering pump. Okay. Whenever you mention the air compressor, water pump. They're gonna be fuel driven. Because there hasn't been a belt driven air compressor since the fucking 60s. Because what happens when the belt breaks? You lose your air pressure for air. Right. So they, they change that over. You're not going to find. Yeah, man, we just stopped at the gas station. Now it's young. I had to give me some water. You feel me? That big alkaline thing. But now it's young boom turn to get in the truck. You feel me? Yeah. I've been watching big videos on how to double clutch this big motherfucker. You feel me? How to switch them 10 gears. You feel me? But yeah, now it's time for me to jump up in this thing and see what it do. You feel me? Got to get ready for that good test that's coming up next week on Thursday. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? We big Freightliner in this thing around here. Y'all see me? Yeah, get me next to the Freightliner ring. You know what I'm saying? Make sure ain't no traffic coming. So I hop on up in here. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Southwest Trucking, man. They gonna get the job done. They gonna get you them CDLs. All right, man, here it go. It's Young Boom trying to jump up in that thing, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Freightliner, new thing right here. Just good seatbelt on. Yeah. About to bend a few counters, man. This good 18 wheeler thing, man. You know what I'm saying? It's just the start. I'm finna be out there beating that road up, man. You know what I'm saying? Go ahead, drop that money in my account, man. You know what I'm saying? Frisco, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? My inspector, Big John, over there coming through. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Easy money, man. Anybody think about getting their CDLs, man? Come to Southwest Truck Driver, man. They're going to make sure you get in there, in and out. So wait. I turn the opposite way and not gets by the last call. A little bit, a little bit more, a little bit more, just, just, 
you want to see a, you want to see the toe itself. Okay, I got the toe. You got it. I got the toe. I got a little baby right where I need her at. She ain't going nowhere. You want, you want the big toe? Right. Come back over here, and you want the beginning of her leg right there. Okay, you just want to rub her leg. Hopefully she ain't got no hair on her. She got both hands. Man, hate that shit. Hairy leg bitches. Usually from Europe. got trailer up here on your right side, right? Okay. We gotta get rid of that. Okay. So we need to go straight. So you go look over there, when the tires come in, the, or trailer tires come in, you, that means you're straight. Watch that side. Glance over here every once in a while and see if you gotta take down the orange cone, right? Okay. Look at that. On the money. Look at that. Yeah. That's a little bit of an angle. Alright. So, we're pretty much good. We got a little bit of an angle. No. Oh. All right, man. You know what I'm saying? I've been learning how to work this uh, this ten shift right here, man, on this manual transmission. But what you want to do is you want to get the clutch down. And now let's just say, you know, you got the hard wall to the left. It's a spring that's going to push it to the middle. And then to the right, you got another hard wall. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to get this thing started in fourth gear with the, uh, with the, with the clicker down right here, right? So uh, that would be fourth. Then uh, I would double clutch, uh, uh, and I would come into five, you know what I'm saying? And I would click it up, and then from five, I would come out, come around, and come down up into six, you know what I'm saying? And from six, I come out, let the spring push it over, and then get it up into seven. Then from seven, I uh, get it down to eight, and then coming up, back to the hard wall, up to nine, and then uh, down to ten. That's when we on the freeway and we rolling right there, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, man, it's boom, boom, moving, man. Y'all be on the lookout for me, man. I'm coming through. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Alright, we good. You can start it off there. Pops for waking me up this morning. I swear I was at that thing knocked out. For real, he like, hey son, any time for you to be at class? I'm like, oh shit, I made it right on time. It's six o'clock on the dot. I got today, tomorrow, and we test on Thursday. Brake chamber and your airline, they're not leaking. They're not damaged. And the pads and the rotors pads are, and not rotors are not damaged. They're probably not insecure. They're not excessively worn. Okay. It's a lot easier to do this one than it is the other. Okay. You, 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 you don't have your uh, you don't have a brake jump, you don't have the linings, you don't have a slack adjust, you don't have the push rod, you don't have to worry about the push rod moving one inch. Mm -hmm. There's no way to, to do, uh, for you and me to test uh, um, whether those brakes are going to DPS, DPS don't even do it. Okay. All right. So, I got one more full day uh, training, you know what I'm saying, at Southwest Truck Driver uh, Training. And uh, after that, it's uh, taking my test on Thursday. And uh, I'm real confident that I'm gonna pass because I've been big studying. As um, soon as I pass, I'm heading over to motor vehicles. I'm gonna take my test for my doubles and my tanker endorsement so that I could, uh, you know, <laughs> have those good endorsements on my license. And, uh, and I'm gonna be big A class, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, I'm gonna go on the road for 
two years. Like the next two years, don't, uh, you know what I'm saying? Strictly running it up on that road. I'm trying to, I'm trying to bust down. I don't even know how many miles, you feel me? But nonstop, no partying, no splurging, no nothing, you feel me? Just straight, mm, getting to it, you feel me? Two years, you feel me? And then I'm big bussy bust down. Wait till y'all see me after that. Yeah, holla at me then. Young boom around this motherfucker. I've been sticking to the script. I just got off the phone with Big Bro. He said, man, I love how you came home and went out of town and ran it up and stuck to your own script. You feel me? But yeah, circle smaller than a dot, man. Just how I like it. All right, so I'm on break right now from class. Uh, today, the last day before it's actually time to uh, take the test tomorrow. And I'm gonna say, man, I was lightweight fucking up for real. I, um, when I did the, the offset, I, I was looking at the little pie down there instead of the landing gear. Um, but long story short, on this last one, you know what I'm saying? I got it all. I got it all right. Got it all together. You know what I'm saying? Knocked it down. And I was looking for, you know, my markers of where I should have my truck. So when it comes time for the offset, you know, when I'm trying to line it up with the wall and with the power line and all of that old good shit, you know, on the ground, my little foot step right there is going to be right behind that uh, concrete line right there. Yep. And then I'm going to turn it to the left and I'm going to bust my move. And then when I get it back straight and I got to start reversing, I'm going to reverse right behind that concrete line again. And when I do that, it's going to put me uh, where that back tire needs to be on that gray line. And, but that's if we doing it on, uh, on two. I mean on three. But two and three is the same. So that same look should work on two and three. But anything besides two and three, well, one, I got one down pack too. That's right next to the wall. But um, yeah, man, I'm ready tomorrow. We just gotta go for the gusto, man. Let's get it.